Have you ever wondered how Hoagrange holidays came to be? So welcome to Hoagrange in the Peak District in the Derbyshire countryside. This is our Daisy Bank cabin and uh, we offer guests uh, facilities for disabled and for horse riding as well. So I thought I'd tell you a little bit about our story and how we started. So uh, my husband David has always been a farmer and been brought up, born and bred here at Hoe Grange and he worked the farm with his father and his brother. So over the years uh, I met David and we got married and we moved into the farmhouse and he continued milking the cows as he always had done. Um, but obviously the milk price in the 2000s uh, was going down, a lot of our expenses were increasing and we were struggling to make enough money to live and we needed to find something that would allow us to continue to live in this beautiful spot but would also provide an additional income. So we looked at various ideas, uh, we looked at um, caravan storage on the farm, um, other types of storage for people. Uh, we also looked at quad biking and events, uh, but settled on the idea of holidays. And this was because about 40 or 50 years beforehand, David's father had thought about putting a log cabin on the farm for holidays. But at that time, he was told by the planners that no, um, Derbyshire doesn't do holidays, little did they know. So he um, didn't go any further with that idea. So we went back to that and we did some market research and we found there was um, quite a large quantity of cottages in the Peak District which offered holidays. So we thought um, there's obviously a market for it, but we wanted to do something different that would um, make us stand out from the crowd. So at that time, they've just designated the High Peak Trail, which adjoins the farm at the top fields, as a national bridleway. So we thought, oh, we could offer bring your own horse holidays. We've got the facilities, we've got the stables, and we've got the fields to ride on. So that would really work, and it's something really different that other people weren't offering. Um, the planning consent also asked, what would we be doing for access? So we thought about it and we looked into um, uh, disabled holidays and providing facilities for people uh, who have limited mobility. And whilst there was a large number in the UK of people who are dis disabled, um, there was no provision at all really for holidays. So we installed a wet room shower in our first cabin in Hipley and never looked back and the facilities that we provide grew as time went on and we added to that and we became accessibility champions and accessibility specialists and um, so that really worked for us so we had two sort of distinctive dishes that um, we were able to pursue which uh, meant that our holidays took off and were a success. So it was a real leap of faith because um, neither David or myself had had any experience in the tourism industry at all. So it was all completely new to us. We didn't know if it was going to work. We didn't know if people were going to come and enjoy our facilities, if we were providing what was needed. And um, David particularly was very nervous because he didn't have people on the farm very often. We had a few representatives from different companies to do with cows that came. But he didn't really talk to, it sounds really odd, but he didn't really um, talk to people. And so he was very nervous about having uh, people around on the farm that he didn't know. However, he took to it like a duck to water and he loves explaining about farm life and what's going on in the world of farming throughout the year with guests and chatting about how we make our food, where our food comes from, all about um, farming indeed. So we've never looked back. Um, so. Little did we know that we were going to be such a success and won, win so many national awards and we absolutely love it. And we are actually missing our guests now at the moment, but um, making plans for next year and looking forward to having some new facilities. So watch this space and you'll find out what they are. See you soon.